Hello friends, welcome back to Deus Ex Human Revolution Director's Cut. I love this music so much, I just can't help but listen to it and get lost in it. Uh, so, it's been a little bit since I've played. Uh, I know we did some stuff and things. Oh man. Where are we? Holy cow, I don't remember this at all. Uh, where are we? <laughs> we have seven Praxis. Wow. Um, let's see if it's worth... I mean, we could sprint a little longer. Reduce chance of being detected. Stealth Enhancer. I don't really care about vision cones. All right, let's uh, let's do that. Uh, hold the interact button to mark. Oh, okay, this is how we can mark. All right, three praxis left. Uh, sprint faster, sure. And aim stabilizer, perfect. But, uh, what I really wanted to do was look at the map. Oh, we're at the Omega Ranch. Okay, I don't know why, but we are. Uh, hack? Security rating 5, okay. Well, let's do it. Of course we're detected. Might as well just stop it now. Access All right. Master Hacker, that's us. What finds us? We finds a lot of money. And retinal implants. I'm sure this is all terribly interesting. Let's continue. I'm supposed to go that way. What's over here, though? Man, I don't remember this at all. What was I doing? What's this one? Hugh Darrow's computer. You know, I'm. You know, we've got a, a bunch of these things. Let's just throw that on it. I definitely want to read Hugh Darrow's computer. From Alan Curtis at VersaLive. Regarding the conversation we had last week, the project is advancing quite swiftly. We've managed to devise a new and improved prototype to better counter the quantum size effect. So far, the nanionics are responding as planned, and the latent effects on biomaterials are negligible. Oh, well, this is quite long. Uh, do you realize what this could mean? We're finally there, a regular looking human being, nothing unnatural in appearance, and still the power of billions of machines within him manipulated at will. This is the future, Mr. Darrow. I do remember that he uh, set off the uh, the AUG incident by turning on the rage virus, if you pardon the um, 28 days later reference. But I don't know exactly where I am. Am I on Panchea? I thought I was in Singapore. No, it was an emergency button. Push the button, Frank. Uh, should we mark these guys? I guess that's probably helpful. Adam, I'm getting my team out of here. You have to go to Panchea and stop Hugh. You and I aren't done with this, Megan. I know how it looks, but you have to stop the broadcast. I think it's causing the new biochips to overstimulate the vagus nerve, creating terrifying hallucinations. You mean it's driving augmented people insane? Yes, and it's up to you to stop it. Use the Leo shuttle. It will take you to Panchea. Good luck, Adam. The Leo shuttle. There's a lot of guys here. And I figured I'd have to get past them, so obviously 
I want to mark them. Oh, actually, I need to go this way. Almost went back up the elevator. Can I not be on this wall? Jeez, dude. Can I mark more? No. I had reached my limit of marking. I mean, do these guys even notice me? I'm walking out here like an idiot. These guys are all hallucinating from the... the... thing. Those were some interesting noises that he made. He is empty. Let's just get out of here, I guess. Take the shuttle to Pinchea. Anything over here? Doesn't look like it. All right. Automated systems online. Darrow sequence one, code one, one A. Preset and ready to engage. Suborbital trajectory plotted. Destination, Panchea. Begin countdown, Mr. Darrow. Yes. Begin countdown. Code, zero, zero, zero. Confirm, zero. Countdown, commence. It's <laughs> a terrible code. Oh, okay. I don't have to fight these guys or anything. I am taking a rocket, apparently, to Antarctica. I love the Deus Ex universe. It's so cool and so ridiculous at the same time. Oh! Wait. Am I going down or up? Oh, I'm going through the center of the Earth. Dude. Oh, no, I'm not. Okay, I'm actually flying in a rocket to space. Yeah, they sent me into low orbit. And they're going to drop me in Antarctica. Shoot failure? Of course there is. Dude. Dude. Man. All right. So I'm assuming Panche is the end of this game. Uh, knowing, you know, sort of the plot of the next game and how it starts... Um, I don't know if we're finishing the game in this episode or if it's going to get broken into two. The way I play, probably two, because I am being very cautious as I go. But it also looks like, to be frank, all hell is broken loose here. Jensen. In Antarctica. Jensen, can you read me? Barely. I've reached Panchea, Pritchard. Any word from Sarah for the UN delegates? Nothing. The installation went into lockdown shortly after Darrow gave his speech. I can't tell if anyone's even alive. And the signal's still broadcasting. Meaning no one's safe till I get in there and shut it down. You'll have to disengage the lockdown What's first. Box? Look for a master control panel at the top of the tower. Is this... No, it's for me to get up here. Uh, why? I wonder if there's anything over there. We should probably go check it out. A lot of boxes. Oh, just wasn't even looking where I was going. That's totally on me. Is that live? Oh, that's not even a mine. It's a gear. Okay. Man. Step away from this game for a little bit and can't even tell items apart anymore. Alright, anything over here? Ice. Probably should not jump down into the ice, huh? No, it doesn't even let you. All right. Something up there? It's open. What's this? Peps? And, uh... Wait, are they both peps? They look very different. Oh, it's a laser rifle battery. Yeah, I want the laser rifle battery, dude. There we go. That's it, though. Oh, we 
got another open one. What's here? Gas grenade, combat rifles. I don't really have a combat rifle anymore, do I? I do have a combat rifle. Oh, okay. I just don't have any space for stuff. Let's use a painkiller. Grab that gas grenade. I guess we're all set. Uh, just seeing if I could reload anything. <laughs> it's only got 15 rounds in the plasma rifle. All right. There's this big sucker. Oh, this looks like it get reloaded. Not enough to clear up inventory space, though. And the silent sniper rifle definitely does not hold 25 rounds. That would be truly remarkable. Okay. I guess we're going down and then up based on that ladder I just saw. So, what do we got here? Nice. Oh, we got money. What's the point of money at this point in the game? Is there going to be a vendor at Panchea? Seems unlikely. Okay. We have a box, and I see some electricity on the ground. And I see a vent. Ooh, that's a lot of electricity. Okay. Definitely going vent. I'm actually curious, like, is this... This is shallow, right? Whoa. That was pretty wild. Okay. Huh. Only certain boxes? Or whatever. Oh, I thought there was a vent. Um, okay, great. I can't go this way. Can I... Uh, not so much. Um, I can't run through that. Maybe I can get up on the side? There we go. All right. Should I bring the box with me? I hear mines. That's what blew up in the water. I don't know who mined this hallway, but somebody did. Um, did I just fall in the water? What just happened, dude? Okay. Electricity is fine. Um. Well. This is, um. This is not great, is it? This is a very bad start, I would say. Right, wooden boxes explode. And, oh, I can reach that somehow. Video game physics. All right. Come on, guys, is there gonna be like a shutoff valve here or what? Okay. Can't reach that. I really need those boxes, buddy. Okay. You're coming with me. Hmm. Well. Come on. There we go. Can I actually turn off the power anywhere in this awful 
place. All right, we're going this way. Let's get away from that death trap. More mines? In a vent? Somebody knows I'm coming. Really? All right. Lining up the laser is different from lining up the iron sights. That looks foreboding. Uh, speaking of foreboding, let's um switch to this gas grenade. I'm on my way. Freaks are everywhere. Soaked the floor outside of the control room and then electrified it with a down power cable. Seems to be working. Ah. There we go. Do I... I mean, it keeps trying to give me peps. I, I've never used peps ever in any Deus Ex game. No playthrough ever of any of them have I done it. Kind of feel like I should backtrack, though. If I can. I don't think I can. Nope. Nobody here. I mean, this place is super creepy. I didn't even see that one. Okay, so this is where I was. I want to go that other direction here. Just to get stand up, dude. I just want to see if there was anything down this other path that I missed. Oh, I can't even search him. It's over here. More bodies. Not looking so good. Grenade launcher and ammo. Oh boy. I don't really care about shotgun cartridges. Um What do you got here? All right, 10 heavy rifle ammo. I'll take that. I feel like I should take the grenade launcher. I mean, it does seem like a logical thing to take, doesn't it? Whereas this plasma rifle, I've only got 15 shots for. Right? I mean, it's cool. That's actually very cool. Um, you know, we're gonna drop the combat rifle. Let's let's see if we can actually fit a grenade launcher here. I'm sure we can't. Sniper rifle ammo, combat rifle ammo. There we go. Where is it? It's over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, grenade launcher. That's cool. Let's see if it can hold more. It can't. <sighs> Two squares, huh? Two squares. Well, I don't have a rocket launcher, but I do have rockets, so I guess that's the trade. And let's just make sure there's... Nope, nothing in this corner. Alright, let's get out of here. And up the ladder. That's what we were doing. Okay, we're in the hangar. You know, let's actually um, just use one of these. There we go. There's like nobody here. It's so creepy. All right, that's outside.
Nothing. I assume at some point I'm going to get attacked by civilians who are rage virus. Oh, that's bait. Nobody reacted. There is a robot. No. Wait. What am I looking at? Oh, it's a robot that's not open. It's still in its shipping container. All right, uh, sure. Security, 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 security. Cool, not a test, not a test. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get uh, EMP grenade ready in case this thing pops to life. I'm assuming it will. Anything back here? I didn't think so. Man, I want that stuff. Uh, let's drop a gas grenade since we have a gas mine. And let's take another EMP. Like, wait, what? That one. Dude, I can't take an EMP? It's the same size. Uh, game? Alright, I can take a frag grenade, but I can't pick up the EMP because it's two. Oh, vent. I didn't even know this was back here. Alright. Where are we going? I hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, please consider subscribing. Uh, most of the views on this series so far have been people who are not subscribed to the channel. And if you want to uh, help keep me motivated to keep oops, <laughs> to keep playing through games and, uh, you know, hopefully providing some entertainment, um, subscriptions go a long way towards doing just that. It let's me know that people are out there watching and paying attention. And I appreciate it. All right, all right. We got a stop worm, we lost a stop worm. Totally fine. Ooh. Shotgun. Nope, I want that. And I don't care about shotgun cartridges. They are really loading me up for a fight, though. It's kind of scary. More rockets. Another vent. Let's see what's in that other door. Oh, okay. This is the robot right here. Beep boop. Uh. Oh, and a ladder. Nope. There we go. We got a vent here, too. I bet this goes down to the other one. Um, there we go. Let's just find out. Yeah, it's a ladder down to the other one. Okay. I wonder um, if that robot is supposed to come to life or not. And there's another vent. Where does this one go? Okay. Pritchard. Panchea's broadcast center is at the base of the station near the bottom of the ocean. Is that right? But the lockdown caused all the blast doors to seal. You won't be able to go down until you override them manually. From up in the tower. I got it. Okay, up in the tower. <laughs> so we gotta go up.
Maybe that's when the robot comes to life. There's a dude hiding up here who still died. Sorry about your luck, dude. You have a rocket launcher. This is a terrible place to use a rocket launcher, man. Oh, are you kidding me? Man. Alright. Oh. Is this the way to it? It does not appear to be. This is where those grenades were. Dude. How do we get up there? Jump on top of the truck? You can jump on top of the truck if you want me to jump on top of the truck. How do you get there? Oh! Okay. Cool. That woke it up. The silenced pistol hitting camera woke it up fantastic it's gonna be looking right at me <laughs> all right was there another pathway I guess we could do this for the experience right This way, this way, man, oh man, oh man, twists and turns. Hi, robot. All right. Let's get back up here, walk along that beam past the rocket launcher dude again. I always go to the wrong side of the ladder, I swear. Wait, could I search him? No. Oh, thanks for the money. Totally useless. Oh, is that's a vent I can get into? <laughs> Didn't notice this last time. And it goes up a little. Oh, well, this is interesting. Huh. This way? Well, not sure what this has done for me. Okay, I think I totally went the wrong way. I could have bypassed everything if I had just come in here to begin with. Interesting. Speedrun strats, I guess. Just go away. Activate self-destruct sequence. All right. Nope. Oh, sprinklers turned on. Nice. Can I not get in this window, though? Like, what's the point of being up here? This is just the other way to go if you were smarter than I was. All right. So I guess we're supposed to not really be up here, then. Man, how do we get up into the tower? As I said, the way I play, we're definitely not finishing this today. <laughs> I don't know.
know what I'm doing. All right, we gotta go this way. No path that way. Wait, have I not been here? Did I somehow miss this area? All right. I got worms. I might as well use them. Oh, fun. It's the security terminal. Machine pistol ammo. What's this? Oh, hacky thing. All right. Well, now we're just back over here. That was just a pointless loop. How do we get up there, dude? How do we get up there? How did I get here? I don't know. I, oh, I went this way. Don't even tell me there's just a door here that I totally missed. There's just a door here I totally missed. Okay, great. Never mind. I'm just an idiot. No jumping in the elevator? You know, people tell you not to jump in elevators. It's supposed to be unsafe. It'll, like, break the chain or something like that. Man, is it so much fun to do? Just bouncing around in the elevator, and every time you jump, it feels like you're falling further th than before. And I don't know. I think it's worth the risk. Also, please don't jump in elevators. I hear it's very dangerous. That's not somebody to talk to. <laughs> I feel like I should grab these plants to scrap them for clay soil. Wrong game. What is this? Ah. All right, let's check out the big room first. Clearly you want me to. Mess hall. Emphasis on mess. Oh, I just closed that locker. All right. And we got some protein powder that I don't have space for. Oh, mess hall was pretty much just a giant waste of time, wasn't it? this. Iron Oceans. Great. Presumably this is taking me to that guard. Yeah, choke his belly. Alright. Ooh. More peps. They really want me to use peps. Uh, okay. That's the same stuff. Oh. There's another peps. I got rid of my plasma rifle. No, I didn't, actually. I just don't have space for it. Um, let's get a little creative. Let's drop that. And then let's reload this. Oh, I can't grab the energy bar. Really? Let's drop this for a sec. 
gonna use the energy bar. And now we need a little space. Um, let's use this. And let's... Let's just drop this. We've got seven stop worms and maxed out uh, hacking, so that's fine. But that was it in this this little weird room. Very weird little room. All right. Oh, is this all neuropazine? Nope, it's soup. Never mind. Okay. So caught up in the lore. Iron Oceans, right. I got caught up in the lore so much that I just assumed it would be neuropazine and not soup. Oh, man. I want to go home from work, buddy. stims are pretty useful, but just ignore that for now. And we've got a thingy. Targets to the left. Let's fortify it. Hack all the things. Oh, I said to hack that one. Hey, I got it. All right. Just wanted my stop worm. Stop worm. Another hypo stim. Another hypo stim. Man, oh man, oh man. Is this a stop worm? That's a nuke virus. <laughs> Some wine. Emergency lockdown. Oh. Uh, thanks. Should I get hypo stims? I don't actually have any. I really should ditch this revolver, but it's a named weapon, and I'm so like this is stupid. I'm just I'm just gonna drop this. I'm running around with this named revolver, but I don't even like the thing. Give me that. Yeah, hypo stim stack. It's totally fine. Goodbye, revolver. Burke was a jerk anyway. Combat rifle ammo. There we go. I like that. Oh, can't actually exit this way, though. And nothing up top. What is this? Heavy rifle cooling system? Give me that, please. Combine. Oh, all right, well, fine, fine. Plasma rifle cooling system. Heavy rifle must already have one. Don't really feel like I'm any closer to getting to the tower, though. Must be this way. Yep, yeah, it's over there. All right, we're on the right floor now. Uh, that's a bit of a path, isn't it? Oh boy, I don't know if I'm going to make this one. Yeah, let's disconnect. Uh, Y is disconnected. I hit RB instead. I guess we're using some stop viruses. Access denied. Oh, I st stopped watching the clock. I gotta wait 20 seconds. Come on, just let me in. Okay. 
Well, at least we know what happened in this hallway. Me all overconfident about my hacking skills, and this is what we gotta do now. Hack. Alright. This way. I got a little confused. Why can't I soften this? You know, I'm not detected. I can actually go get this now. Dude! Excellent, Man, Grant. it's being really weird about actually capturing the nodes. Alright. We've got... Yep. This is the hacking episode, I guess. Let's go this way and this way. Come on. Can't fortify. Alright, whatever. Uh... Wait, there really are no enemies, are there? Let's, uh... Deactivate that camera. And put it on enemies just in case, I guess. No vent. Interesting. I'll take that. Nope. Just, I want... I want the gas grenade. Alright, let's put that down. Pick up that. Okay. So it does count as two separate items. So if I do that, then I should be able to pick up the mine. There we go. It's a kind of convoluted way of doing it, game. Hi, friend. You, um, really did a lot of work here. Okay. Out the window we go, I guess. I've... Oh, okay. I was gonna explore more, but fine. You do you, cutscene. I don't think you want to do that, Mr. Jensen. Disengage lockdown, and whatever demons this station contains are likely to come crashing out on us. Afraid to die, Darrow? Or just unwilling to face what you've done? Oh, I know what I've done, believe me. I take no pleasure in it. And yet you still did it. I did what had to be done. Twenty years ago, I gave the world augmentation technology. I thought I was giving it a bright future, but instead I gave it the means to destroy itself. No law, no UN regulation was going to fix that. People are dying out there. Hundreds of thousands of people driven to the brink of insanity because of you. I had to convince the world. Before today, people believed we should steal fire from the gods and redesign human nature. Human nature is the only thing we have that gives us a moral compass and the social skills we need to live in peace. Destroy it, and you destroy our very species. Don't paint yourself a savior in this. What you're doing is insane. Is it? When this is done, the Illuminati won't be able to control men and women like you as they had planned from the inside out. No one will be able to use the technology I invented to make others into beings they desire. Something we both know has happened already. You think you're Frankenstein? Killing his own monster? Actually, Mr. Jensen, I prefer to think of myself as Daedalus, watching helplessly as his child crashes into the sea. Well, that was... dark. I mean... I'm ending now. Of course it was, but, you know. You can't. The signal is being generated from the broadcast center at the base of this facility. Pancheya's security system has been programmed to protect it. And it'll kill you before you even get I took down place. Apex and Shadowrun, man. System, Darrow. You can tell me how to shut it down. But I won't. You think what I'm doing is extreme. You simply don't understand. 
For humanity to survive beyond this century, it must abandon ill-conceived notions about Not used to resistance and embrace change. But for that to happen, the hard lesson must be learned. Blood must be shed. It's already happened. Uh, tends to dismiss other people. Emotional wall. Educator of lesser people. And I can't use my... Uh... Alright. Not used to resistance. What you're doing is horrific. It has to stop. You can't force people to change. They have to do it on their own or they'll end up resenting you for it. And doing it like this... My god, Darrow, it's insane. It is not insane, Mr. Jensen. Tragic, yes. Unavoidable, no. You, of all people, should be able to understand this. In your former career, were you not sometimes called upon to kill in the line of duty? To carry that grim responsibility in order to save others? You must realize this is no different. Only the scale has changed. Because the threat we face as a species is so extreme. Hmm. And I can't use my Cassie thing. Maybe I didn't buy it. Maybe I lost it and I forgot to get it again. I thought I had done it though. You want us to see what you see, but how can we when we're grieving over the people you forced us to leave behind? Stack of innocent victims. Uh, nothing more to say, Mr. Wait, Jensen. Dude, I was looking at my options. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're wrong. None of it matters because this is what will happen now. After today, whatever you say will be dismissed as the ravings of a mass murderer. You were one of the greatest minds of our time, and tomorrow you'll be nothing but a killer. I have shown the world the worst of itself, Mr. Jensen. As long as people understand that, what they say of me doesn't matter. Hmm. Quite frankly, I don't even know why I'm listening to you. Well, that was the wrong There's thing to say. You can say I haven't said to myself at one point or another. The difference, Mr. Jensen, is that I know people like you need this wake-up call. You will never freely give up your augments. Your desire for their power blinds you to the danger you put humanity in. Uh, I did not choose this. Omega. All right. Omegas are susceptible to pressure. You know, I've always wondered about that leg brace of yours. Where the father of augmentation doesn't have the most basic of implants. It doesn't make much sense, really. Unless he's one of the few people genetically incompatible with this technology. <laughs> Gotta love the irony in that. It's the kind of irony that can tear you up inside, bit by bit, every day, until you find yourself despising what you're not. How dare you? You think I've done all this because... because a fluke of nature robbed me of my chance to become a part of it? I tried everything, damn you! Everything I could think of to change! None of it worked! None of it! So you had to fix it, didn't you? Take back control, make it like it never was. Yes! Yes, that's exactly what I... What I... I... What have I done? Give me the codes, Daryl. Help me stop this. You'll still be in danger. Panchea's security system, much of it is self-determining. And lethal. But if you succeed, if these codes help you turn off the system and reach the broadcast center, tell the world exactly why I did it. Explain to them about the Illuminati, the biochip, Panchea. Help them understand that the technology I created will not be a future any one of us desires. Hmm. Okay, so all I had to do was uh, pick on him about his leg, basically. And now I can shoot him in the head. Which I probably shouldn't do. Ah, the speech. 
David, forgive me. He actually had that written down. Uh, all right. Do I have the codes then? I mean, he threw them on the ground, but I don't see them there. Am I supposed to shoot Darrow in the head? I mean, I could have also found the codes on the chip inside of his coat. So, just leave him here. Not like he's gonna run away. Richard, the lockdown's disengaged. I'm heading back to the hangar to see if those blast doors are open. Have you been able to raise anyone? I'm picking up several glimmers, but there's too much interference. I... I think you're... on your own, Jensen. Careful there, Francis. You almost sound like you regret that. Do have any space left? Oh, boy, I got a nuke virus. Great. I don't remember how to get out of here. This way? That's a bathroom. This way. That's the Iron Seas thing. Oh. I was not expecting guys. I don't want to hit you guys. Oh, jeez, there's a lot of them. Okay. <laughs> nice. Okay. Hey, dude. Okay, fine. You're making me do this. I'm trying not to hurt you guys. Nope, stop. Like, am I really gonna die to these idiots? They do not seem to be stopped by bullets either. <laughs> Wrong weapon. <laughs> Wrong weapon. That was that was worth it. All right. Well, now we know there's guys. I'm supposed to go this way. Wait, oh, I'm going the wrong way. I got so turned around from that. That's that room. Okay. Bathroom. Let's switch over to a uh, gas grenade here since there's so many of them. Maybe we just knock them all out. Don't turn, don't turn. Oh, right. Uh. Okay. There's so many of them. Stop playing around. Uh oh. <laughs> Wrong door. There we go. See you guys. Let's switch to a gas mine this time. I don't know why it changed from silenced pistol to grenade launcher. I mean, of all the weapons to automatically change over to, that's what we're going to go with. There's those ammo boxes. Looks like there's a lot of guys down there. Now, where am I going? That way. 
Okay. Well, we explored this area quite thoroughly. There's quite a few of them down there, though. These guys are tripping big time. That's not where I wanted that to go. No one's here. Come get out of here. Was it my fault? They made me do it. Come on, man. What the fuck? Must have been the wind. It must have been the wind. It must have been the wind. That's amazing. I don't think that guy is going to see me. Must have been the wind. <laughs> Alright, later guys. Oh, look at that. Yoink. One guy saw me. Whatever. Just let me finish. Just you don't know how to crawl finish. through a vent I anyway. Oh now am I going up this ladder again? Or no, it's through here. Then up the ladder. And they're all down a floor, right? Nope, they are not. So I gotta get past all these guys. I can try to get to this vent. Good thing I explored. Now, do I want to go up? I don't, doesn't look like it. Nothing? Can I, uh, get in here? There we go. Got lunch, coffee, sandwich, sniper rifle ammo, heavy rifle ammo. We got one round. All right. Ooh, I like this music here. Attitude problem. Global warming is no joke. Oh my goodness, I am not going to read that. But I agree with you, dude. It's a very twitchy guy down this corner. Must have been the wind. This can't go on. A lot of nothing in here. And ten credits. More stuff I can't search. Life made better. All right. Painkillers. I'll take. No, oh, I guess I won't take those. I will. I thought I had some in my inventory. Um, let's drop this. Grab it. 
use it. Pick that back up. Nothing. Nothing. What was the point of this room? Painkillers? That's not much, dude. You stay there. So I'm going this way. It's a lot of bodies, but some of them might be ready to hop up, potentially. I'm guessing I gotta go that way, but let's try down here. Oh, hey. Put that weapon away. Hasn't that been <laughs> there is a merchant. Uh, yeah. You seem relatively normal. Nishbar? All things considered, yeah. Yeah. You okay? Das ist frei. I was able to barricade myself in here when things got out of control. So, <laughs> so I will be your merchant. No. The rest of the station is still under siege. You better stay here until help comes. In the meantime... Is it possible to download Praxis software here? Yes, of course. No damage was done to the computers. See for yourself. Yes. Shop. Oh my goodness. Yeah, give me those. Uh, I guess I'll buy those. And you won't buy anything for me? Okay. I will remain here. Where it Thank, thanks for being the vendor at the end of the game. Mech style. What's this? Oh, I want love. <laughs> See the wind turn the rudder. All right. No doubt you've been receiving complaints. Over the next few days, your clinic will be receiving a shipment. Study the implant procedure carefully. All right. Must have been the wind. All right, later, lady. We've got. Yeah, we took that. All right, so we've got three Praxis available. Fortify. Eh. Typhoon system. Eh. Maybe invisibility? I don't care about that. Aim stabilizer. Reduces recoil. Alright, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do aim stabilizer. And we're gonna reduce recoil. Twice. Okay. I love the merchant at the end of the game. If anyone out there is listening, I'm begging you, help. We've barricaded ourselves inside the core server room. Many of us are wounded. Please, save us. Please, save us. I don't know, Taggart. Oh. Back to having guys to avoid. That's quite a few of them, actually. Can I just jump down? Oh, that's when I want it. Unlocker thing. Look at all these guys. There's no way I can get over there and hack this fast enough with all these guys around. <laughs> He's like a guy acting like a bear. Yeah. 
Everybody go to sleep now. Okay, all but you two. That's fine. Now you're all asleep. Oh, except for those couple of guys, but that's better. Okay, we gotta go this way. We're just gonna stay on target. Access Easy. Granted. What's in here? Oh, look at that. Nope, that. Heavy rifle ammo. It really is giving me a lot of ammo here. Um kind of don't want to drop any of this stuff. I mean, the new virus software or whatever, but look at the size of a heavy rifle ammo. We don't have... There's not that much stuff I want to drop. Nope. I don't know you. Oh, these guys are totally raging. They're doing the crazy legs thing. Do I want to jump down? Would that be quicker? I don't think so. Hmm. <laughs> Later, guys. Is there anybody on this floor? I hope not. <sighs> There's a bunch of them. But if I jump here... I know I'm going the wrong way, but maybe I can skirt past a lot of these guys? Oh. I mean... I mean... <laughs> I hope I don't regret this. You know what, let me just save real quick. Hey guys. <laughs> awesome. Oh, all right, didn't actually knock him out. I thought it was gonna be like stun as in knock out. You're next. I think breaking his arm was kind of unnecessary. Oh, hang on. Where's my granola bars? Yeah, just, you could have just elbowed him in the head, dude. It was really unnecessary. No. No. I like that they're all dressed the same, though. All right. Was Is anybody there? Seraph? Can you hear me? I've got survivors here. We've locked ourselves in the machine room. Please! Help us! That? Oh, that was not okay. Uh... Was I supposed to go get Taggart first? Oh, there's a lot of guys over there. Oh, I think I tagged somebody accidentally. Look at how many guys there are. That radar is wild. Oh, we got a vent there, though. Who do you see? Come on, just go away, dude. There's a way back up to get Taggart. 
Didn't intend to leave him behind. Oh, there's Seraph right there. What the hell do you think you're doing, son? Put that away. Oh my goodness. Adam! Oh, thank God you came. I've got wounded here. We'll have to move them first. We can't move anyone yet. Not until I get to the base of the station and shut down Darrow's broadcast. What? Why? The chaos you experienced here? It's everywhere. The Illuminati created a biochip that stops people from using enhanced abilities, and Darrow turned it into a kill switch. Oh my god, you... We gotta fix this, Adam. If people realize what's happened, if they believe augmentation technology created this chaos... That's well, kind of not the point, the man. Forever. And that would be a bad thing. Yes, it would! Don't you see what's at stake here? Ever since man first crawled out of that ocean, we've been striving to be more than we are. Augmentation technology is just the latest, greatest step on a very long road. But we've barely scratched the surface of its potential. We can't let fear stop us from continuing. That's your belief, Sarah. Not everyone shares it. But you do, Adam. I know it. And if we work together, we can really make a difference. We can improve the lives of everyone, but only if we fix this. Go on. We'd have to get a message out. After you shut down Hugh's signal. Tell the world. Tell them the Humanity Front did this. That their doctors created a virus that only affects augmented people. You mean lie. Uh, it'll give us time, son. Time to figure out how to destroy the Illuminati's biochips and move on. And what about the people who've been hurt by this? Don't they deserve the truth? I had them. If we want the freedom to become more than we are, we can't be blinded by a misguided morality. Some people will be left behind. It's reality. It's evolution, son. Right. Evolution based on my DNA. Please, son, you have to stay with me on this. I'll think about it. Okay, that did not go the direction I expected. I like this um, water pool, though. We got some liquid cooling going on here. Tell me you're here to rescue us. I hear a mine. Why do I hear a mine? That's why. Hey, JC, that's a nice shout out to the uh, original protagonist of Deus Ex. It's okay. Oh, God. Peps. Tranquilizer. Tranquilizer darts. Alright. Um, how do I get to Taggart? I'd actually like to go talk to Taggart. Oh. Wait, were these guys already... These guys look like they were already dead. Alright. Direct route. Come on. Capture the stupid thing. Capture. It's like less responsive than normal today. I don't know what's up with that. Let's just use a stop worm and move on. They're all right on the other side of this door. So many of them. Oh, there's another mine. Um. Hate using the bullet here. Please don't open the door. Another one? Come on. Oh. Really? What is up with this mine? I don't get it. <laughs> Alright, whatever. You do you, game. More heavy rifle ammo? 
Another plasma rifle. Man, I've got so much ammo. Um, can this... That only holds 20 rounds. That's unfortunate. Alright. I mean, I do feel like I should take the heavy rifle ammo. Oh, I probably shouldn't be punching this hole. Oh yeah, that's where all the guys are. Okay, maybe that's the way I have to go to go higher up, though. Oh, they are all right behind me. And this is not a dead end, but I can close the door. <laughs> I did not realize they were all right there. Great. What's in here? Uh oh. Yeah. Okay. Nope. Yes, I would like that. What do we got? Die you forgotten. All right. Let's hide in the corner for a second. Have ourselves another box of granola bars. If we've got them, we do not. We've used them all. All right. Everybody's uh, calm now. Well, I mean, obviously not. Yeah, you don't got anything on you. Now, where am I? Wrong button. Sorry, guys. Um, I want to look at my missions here. Alright, what do we got? We've got... Reach the broadcast center. Oh, we're just going to ignore Taggart, I guess. Because I jumped down the hole. What if I go that way? Wait, where was Taggart? Change level. I don't know. Maybe it's too late to talk to Taggart. I don't see him anywhere. Alright. Well, sorry, Taggart. Good night. So many of them all over this place. This is crazy. And I gotta go that way. There's a lot of guys there. Whoa. Oh, they're hostile. Alright. Door. Closed door. Uh, more heavy rifle ammo. Are they expecting me to be killing all these guys? Because I'm really trying not to. Since I know where this is going plot-wise. You know, in the next game. And it's totally not these guys' fault that they're homicidal madmen. Machine room. Well, where's the core server room? I I legitimately did want to talk to Taggart. I guess I should have done that before I jumped in the hole. Well, we seem to be going pretty far... Up. Some more guys. Is this Darrow's signal here? Nobody there. Boy, does this feel like a cutscene waiting to happen. Let's get um, the plasma rifle equipped 
and a gas mine, just in case I have a boss fight here. Hmm. Okay, I guess not. Did I def did I just totally miss my chance at Tiger? I really did not intend to. Ring station. Stairs. Wish I could see what the things were. Alright. Sorry, Bill. This is kind of neat. Is it like a laser security thing? I'm going to drop down here. I don't know if that's something else flickering. I don't know what's going on there. Oh, I bet it was my laser. <laughs> uh, huh. You are telling me there's a boss fight right at the top of these stairs, game. It... <clears throat> it might be time to drop this pistol. This makes me sad. Pistol's been with us since day one. It was a vent and gas. And an ammo thing. Oh, no. Alright, let's sneak over here. Alright, where's the shutoff valve? I don't see one. We're gonna go back in there one more time. We're gonna see what that was on the sh on the desk. Just waiting for my oxygen to be all gooder. Uh, I thought I saw something on the desk. There, that. Oh, it's money. Um, cigarettes. Great. <laughs> all right. Well, that was. Not what I hoped for. Um, man, now I got rid of my other weapons, so now it just feels like everything is super overkill. Let's switch to this, I guess. If we really need to use it. Can you walk that way a little bit, buddy? Can knock out a bunch of you with the same grenade. There we go. Thanks, dude. All right, fine. Just not being cooperative like a bell tower guy usually would be. No, you're totally fitting in with the stereotype bell tower. All right. Gas dispersed. Oh, hey, guy. There's like no other way. Oh, there is. You shouldn't be here. Only I can be here. Oh. Do they know I'm here? I'm not sure. I'm surprised they're not fighting each other. That's that's the one thing that I don't quite understand. Oh, I could hack that security terminal in that gas room, I bet. And make that turret kill all these guys. This is creepy and horrifying. Alright, what is this? Crazy work. That's not what I meant. What is the red barrel? Alright. Uh, uh. Uh. I have an idea. I think the gas is coming from these canisters in the corner. Will the gas disperse now? I 
doesn't seem like the gas is going to disperse. Oh, it's being pumped in from a vent. Oh. Okay. Alright. I did not realize that. Regain our breathing, and let's see if we have a code for this terminal. <sighs> How long is it going to take to hack? This is stupid. Access granted. Yep. Uh, interact. Nope. Interact. Enemies. Sorry, guys. Didn't want to. Really didn't want to. I'm sure there was a way to sneak past all of them, but... This video has gone on pretty far. We're almost an hour and a half in. I feel like we're just so close to the end of the game, especially since we didn't talk to Taggart. Seraph wants us to lie. Which... Is this... Oh, this is bringing us down to the lower section. This actually might be a good place to stop if it's going to bring us to a whole new area. Oh, it wants us to take this thing? I mean, we could probably jump with our Icarus suit, right? No turning back. Okay. Find and speak with Tiger. Yeah, I couldn't find a way back up. So... Yeah, uh, also a thousand meters down, probably shouldn't try the Icarus jump. So I guess while this thing is descending, I am going to bid you all farewell. I have no idea how much is left in this game. I assume there's some sort of horrific boss fight because they gave us so much ammo, but maybe the boss fight was just the mob. I really don't know. Um, that's what happens when you play a game blind. I can rub my face against this, though. Um... <laughs> Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, uh, please give it a thumbs up. Please consider subscribing to my channel. And we will resume Deus Ex Human Revolution Director's Cut and presumably finish the game next week. Same bat time, same bat channel. As always, please be kind to yourselves and each other. And once again, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next episode.